wish you could feel my cheeks right now. You could fry rashers on these things. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I overdone the baking. Me and my compadre. Welcome to my first ever YouTube video. I am beyond excited. I've wanted to do this for so long. Like, literally so long. But I just never had the balls. But here I am. Um, so I'm just getting ready to go out tonight. Also, Please excuse the state of my cheeks. I think I'm allergic to something I'm using in my hair because any time I wash my hair, like an hour later, my cheeks are like expanding <laughs> by the second and are so red. I just, they're so warm. Like, I wish you could feel my cheeks right now. You could fry rashers on these things. Um, yeah, but my first ever video... Ah! So exciting. Um, just... It's gonna be kind of random. I'm just gonna be doing bits and bobs, like... Basically, my video is just gonna be random bits here and there of what I'm doing and, like, just, you know, until I get used to everything. But tonight I am going out with the girlies and um, I'm gonna have to get ready. Cree is sleeping. That's me so cute. Um, yeah. So the next time you'll probably see me, I am going to be getting ready and I'll do like a little get ready with me thing that's not really going to be a get ready with me thing because I'm not going to record it all because it literally takes me I'm not going to say five hours but five hours to get ready and I'm not being dramatic and I tend to be dramatic sometimes but I'm not being dramatic Um. also I'm so sorry I'm such a hand user when I'm talking and it's kind of annoying but there's nothing I can do about it because it's just a habit now. Fun fact, my principal used to give out to me in secondary school because he was like why do you always use your hands you're so dramatic and I was like I am sorry mister but I can't stop now because this is how I was raised you know but yeah that's, that's the tea on my principle. I'm excited to do this. I'm so excited. I'm literally buzzing. I can't believe I'm actually doing it. But um, I just feel like it's the right time to start, to start a YouTube because I have stuff coming up that are exciting and like I'm always on the go and I just feel like it's the perfect time you know between having my bambino the process of building a house getting my college done there's just a lot of things going on so I just think it's perfect timing and it's all so exciting I actually look insane. My uncle just came to the house there and he was like, what is on your face? And I was like, it's called baking, Philip. Okay? Don't judge me. But um, no, I do look crazy. But it's part of the process. It is part of the process. Um, So yeah, I'm just going to let let it sit for a while and I might have a coffee might do that 
or might not because I have two already today and it's literally only like one or something. Um, also excuse the mess back there, this room is like Cree's little bits and bobs and all of his like clothes that he doesn't fit into yet so this room is just hectic um i took my whitening strips out there well hello can you see <laughs> That was too close. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna go down now. And maybe have some, I might opt for a green tea instead of coffee. And maybe like a cereal bar, cause I am, I am a little peckish. And I'm not gonna be heading out till like six or half six. So I'll have something before that. <laughs> Actually yesterday I made some tofu with a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper and sweet chilli. It was so nice. It was so, so nice. And like, I can never get tofu right. I can never get it to taste nice. Well, it doesn't taste bad, but there's just no taste on tofu. But oh my god, the sweet chilli. It was so nice. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm gonna go downstairs now. I might bring you with me. To go. Oh my god, this lighting makes me look even more crazy. Go get some tea. Wow. <laughs> oh my <laughs> I overdone the baking. I over I look crazy because I'm in like a dark room with a ring light so I look it didn't look this extreme no wonder Philip thought I looked like a monster oh, do you know what's the worst thing ever when you come down to make tea and there's no water in the kettle so you have to fill the kettle up that gets me that really gets me for this absolute beast Jupiter. Mm. Yeah. I'm gonna stand outside for like two seconds just to get some vitamin D. It's so nice today. I actually love fresh air. It just makes you happy. And when the weather's like this, it's just such a boost of serotonin. But yeah. Here are my views. I don't know if you can see from here but you can see the cliffs some more. I wanna zoom in. See the cliffs some more there? Yep, that's the cliffs some more. And they are the Iron Islands. Now fun facts. I'm gonna go in because the kettle is boiled. Oh my god wait. Wow I did not realise I was zoomed in. Okay. Zooming in more. Oh my. Um. Do you know what the worst thing is about putting teeth whitening strips in? I get this like guilt whenever I eat or like drink after having them in. It's so bad. I literally get this like guilty feeling. Which cup will I choose? I might go for a Christmas one because. Merry Christmas, you know? Look at this little Christmas mug. Go over to the green tea. Pop. There was literally just the right amount of water. I am not refilling and I know I'd be giving out if that was me 
and my mom didn't refill or someone didn't refill but I got things to do people to see I have nothing to do I'm just being lazy um I actually have to lock the door because the dogs can let themselves in especially Poppy Poppy is a master of opening the door and then Jupiter is slowly but surely picking up Poppy's tricks and like you could be upstairs and you hear noise downstairs and you're like you're scared good morning so the last time I was talking to you I was getting ready to go out so I've been out I'm home, it's the next morning, it's 12 o'clock. I've been up since six o'clock this morning. I've been up because Cree woke me up. He got up at six o'clock, bright and early. I'm going to do some college work and maybe go for a walk on the prom. later and oh, I'd love to get a cheeky takeaway I would I'd love that but I'm not going to because I'm being God I might though um yeah I'm at nothing crazy today I'm just relaxing I'm taking it all in you know no, sorry though. Like, why are my cheeks so red? Why? <sighs> like, I swear I don't have blotter on them. I don't know why my cheeks get so red recently. Oh, do you know what it might be? I've been using retinol recently. It's new in my skincare. So that's possibly it. Hello. So we are getting ready to go for lunch with my mother. Are you excited, Kyle? Very. Right. <laughs> yeah. It's been a like two days since I last videoed anything. So the last video you seen, or is it the last video you saw? Either or, the last video was like two days ago. Hello, okay, so the last time I was talking to you was yesterday, I think. I'm here with Anya. We went to my call in to get coffees and then we're going to walk in Berna? Yeah, Berna Woods or Berna Spital Woods Prom. or Spittle Prom. So, and we got these bad boys. Extreme. I don't think you can see them. And they're meant to be literally fire in your mouth. Like. I'm going to die. So we're going to taste test them. I actually don't have water either. I have water. But you know, I think hot stuff so coffee won't be better fresh. Oh really? Mm-hmm. Come on free, I'm not even coming back. I know. Like, Go with it. Anya's nervous. <laughs> I was like, oh. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, where's Timbala? No. Oh, it doesn't really smell good. It doesn't smell good, but let's give them a try. Right. Let's do like okay, you go a good chunk. Let's do it together. Okay, okay. I'm gonna take like Oh yeah, I have three. Okay. They smell warm. Warm. Hot? <laughs> One, two, three. Okay. Three? Yeah. I'm not getting anything yet. Are you? After you swallow it, I feel like. But it's still... I feel I've built my tolerance with spicy food though. Like I eat jalapenos and stuff now. Mm. I think if I would have had them before, there is an aftertaste of spice. Yeah. I'm getting the spice now. Like, I think if mom had them now, she'd be like, ah, Oh, my, yeah. But, no. I think they're actually okay. I don't know what I eat them for just enjoyment, though. I wouldn't. No. I'd give them a, like... Is this spicy rating or, like, niceness? Niceness, like, five. 
Mm. Or even four. I'd say four. Yeah. They're not the more you tasty. Taste, the spicier they get. Okay, I'm getting, my mouth is getting hot now. Yeah, same. I'm getting. I want to keep going until I can't. Go, no, mine. Are, my mouth is getting hot. I shouldn't be eating these. I'm going to coffee. My mouth is getting really hot. Mm. And you know what's the worst thing? You know thing? what I don't like if you eat spicy food though. Like we've literally like loads of sweets here. Yeah. And I'd hate if everything else tasted different because of the spiciness. The spicy. Oh shit. My you should have left this for the end. My tongue. I'm fine again though after coffee I think. Okay I'm going to have some coffee because. I feel like I'm talking to a friend. You're our such friends. A good friend. Such a good listener. <laughs> such a good <laughs> listener. So this is the vibe. Cute vibes. Really cute vibes. Cutesy vibes. It's so pretty. So relaxing. Here's the little birdies. I've demolished my coffee. And I'm still like I had a so much talking all the way down the road that I, I woke up. I literally had a large. She has a regular cup. I had a large, and mine demolished. But yeah. yeah. But then, what's new though? Can Absolutely. <laughs> but yeah, that's the vibe. Hey guys, so it's nine o'clock. I am absolutely wrecked. Like, I'm so tired. Um, me and Kyle went out. No one out, we just went, well, yeah, we went out with the, me and Kyle went out with the girls last night and he went out with his friends and we were home at like half twelve but I am just wrecked. And like Kree was so good last night, he got up at three and then got up at seven. Like, so good. But I'm just so tired. And I am going on a road trip with the girls this morning, so I think we're leaving. Oh, there's enough water in our kettle. We're leaving at like 12, I think. So I want to make myself a coffee. Um, I actually ordered the coffee and the tree that i last day. Not the like coffee, but um, the nutmeg creamery. And I already used almond milk, so. But I'm really, like I'm dying to try it. It's meant to be so nice. I already use collagen creamer, like vanilla collagen creamer, in my coffee, so I'd say I like it. And I also ordered a blender because in the first lockdown, I used to make myself celery juice every morning and drink, was it like 20 ounces of celery juice every single morning, like religiously. I'd wake up. First thing I'd have is celery juice, go outside, drink it, and I just felt so good. Like, I'd done it for a solid three months, I think, but then I broke the blender because I put, stupidly, I put ice in with the celery just to make it colder. I'm pretty sure you're able to put ice, it's probably just a faulty blender, but yeah, I broke it. So I just haven't purchased one since, but I bought one the last day and I'm dying to get back on the celery juice bandwagon. Um, but yeah, I will take you with me today because I feel like it's going to be a fun day. And just, we'll have fun, you know, we'll have fun. It's needed today. Just me and a friend. Me and my compadre. I feel like all I do is talk to you in front of the laptop because I'm always leaving my college work to last minute. And I have a presentation due, well just the slides to the presentation due today at five. And I haven't even started. And it is six minutes past 11. Why do I, like, why do I do this to myself? 
before every assignment i'm like i want to start so early on this so i'm not panicked or pressured and no i don't um i feel so stressed out today as well because there's just a lot coming up in the next month month or two like in may and june it's just a busy month i have exams in may I have my birthday and I'm trying to organise Chris christening. There's just a lot going on, you know. So I think I'm actually, before I'm going to do any assignment, I'm just going to do a list of things that I need to organise and, and to do because I feel like if the list is there, it'll just calm me a bit. Because right now I'm like, I have to do this, I have to do that, I have to do this. And I'm just out of control. But... Yeah, if I do that, I feel like I'll be calm. But this is... I made myself coffee this morning. I haven't tasted it yet because I'm drinking my green tea first. I used to be so good drinking green tea. Like, I'd have maybe five a day. But then just coffee overtook my life. So now I'm just trying to balance it. Trying to have some green tea. Ooh, green tea as well as coffee but this is the coffee and honestly it's the vibe for today a mason jar as big as your head i'll take that i'm gonna do taste test now mm. she's good she's strong but that's what we like um, also I add a little funky straw just for aesthetic purposes. You know, just makes it look more fun. But yeah, I feel like all I do is talk to you in front of this bloody laptop. I can't wait till I have all my assignments done and dusted and all my exams done so I can have more fun with you, you know? Taking more vitamins. Let's get to work. Does anyone else have like a favorite mug that they rotate to? <gasps> like I hadn't used this in like a month because I had another favorite mug, but now I'm back, back at it. I love a good mug, love a good mug. Like if I go into any homeware stores or like game over cause straight to the mugs. I've been looking for ages for like a double walled glass mug but they're so hard to get cause I want like a big one and the ones I see like on Amazon they're not big enough. So if anyone knows where I can purchase an extra large double walled glass mug let me know. So I'm just about to head out. I have to head to the church. I have to pick up Cree's christening for him and then I have to hand them his birth cert. Well, a copy of his birth cert. And then kill two birds with one stone. And while I'm there, I'm actually going to pick up my baptismal cert and my confirmation cert because I need them for planning for the house and as well as that I have to check my emails because I have an exam at two it is currently quarter to one and Kyle had an exam today as well so I'm just waiting for Kyle to come back and we're both gonna head and then I have to be back by two so it's just wild over here. It's crazy. It's just hectic. 
Um, but yeah, that's the plan for today. So at the end of every video, I am going to pick out a quote and share it with you guys. So the quote I picked for this week is, and I've loved this quote for so many years. So it's, what if I fall? Oh, but my darling, what if you fly? I think that's just such a good quote. And I have it here. There. I think it's just so nice. It says here it's from Erin Hansen and Winnie the Pooh. But I don't know if that's a Winnie. I'm actually going to Google that. I don't. It might be a Winnie the Pooh quote. If it is, hats off to Winnie the Pooh because that's a good quote. It's such a lovely quote. It's a saying for if you're doubting yourself or if someone else is doubting themselves, you can just use that quote to encourage them. And that's it for my first ever vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will chat soon.